been having these weird thoughts lately. Like, is any of this for real? Or not? is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kyrie. Kyrie's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. I'm not afraid of the darkness. Riku? Are you all right? Yeah. So, why did you go along with him anyway? I'm looking for someone. Hades promised to help. I tried to exploit the power of darkness, but it backfired. I fell into darkness, and I couldn't find the light. You'll find it. I'm searching too. For your light? Don't lose sight of it. How about a rematch sometime? Fair and square, no dark powers involved. I think I'll pass. Quit while you can. No, not without Kyrie. The darkness will destroy you. You're wrong, Riku. The darkness may destroy my body, but it can't touch my heart. My heart will stay with my friends. It'll never die. Really? Well, we'll just see about that. Ah! Sora ain't gonna go anywhere. You'd betray your king? Not on your life. But I'm not gonna betray Sora either, cause he's become one of my best buddies after all we've been through together. See you later, Donald! Could you tell the king I'm really sorry? Hold on, Goofy! We'll tie him together! Well, you know, I'm the wrong and right for all. I guess you're stuck with us, Sora. Thanks a lot, Donald Goofy. How will you fight without a weapon? I know now I don't need the Keyblade. I've got a better weapon. My heart! <laughs> Your heart? What good will that weak little thing do for you? Although my heart may be weak, it's not alone. It's grown with each new experience, and it's found a home with all the friends I've made. I've become part of their heart just as they've become a part of mine. And if they think of me now and then, if they don't forget me, then our hearts will be one. I don't need a weapon. My friends are my power. Huh? Huh? <gasps> 
there is so very much to learn. You understand so little. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. Take a look at this tiny place. To the heart-seeking freedom, this island is a prison, surrounded by water. And so this boy sought out to escape from his prison. He sought a way to cross over into other worlds, and he opened his heart to darkness. Don't bother. Your voice can no longer reach him where he is. His heart belongs again to darkness. All worlds begin in darkness. And all so end. The heart is no different. Darkness sprouts within it. It grows, consumes it. Such is its nature. In the end, Every heart returns to the darkness whence it came! You see, darkness is the heart's true essence. That's not true! The heart may be weak, and sometimes it may even give in. But I've learned that deep down there's a light that never goes out. So you have come this far, and still you understand nothing. Every light must fade, every heart return to darkness! A scattered dream that's like a far-off memory. A far-off memory that's like a scattered dream. I want to line the pieces up. Yours and mine. Oh, my kingdom hearts. Ruined. No. I'll have to start all over again. Warriors of the Keyblade, go forth and bring me more hearts. No! Denizens of Light, answer this. Why? Do you hate the darkness? Ha, huh, we don't hate it. It's just kinda... scary. But the world's made of light and darkness. You can't have one without the other. Cause darkness is half of everything. Sorta of makes you wonder why we are scared of the dark. It's because of who's lurking inside it. Then allow me another question. You accept darkness, yet choose to live in the light. So why is it that you loathe us who teeter on the edge of nothing? We who were turned away by both light and dark, never given a choice. That's simple. It's because you mess up our worlds. That may be. However, what other choice might we have had? Just give it a rest. You're nobodies. You don't even exist. You're not sad about anything. <laughs> Very good. You don't miss a thing. I cannot feel sorrow. No matter what misery befalls the worlds, no matter what you think, what you feel, or how you exist. Thinking of you wherever you are. We pray for our sorrows to end. And hope that our hearts will blend. Now I will step forward to realize this wish. And who knows? Starting a new journey may not be so hard. Or maybe it's already begun. 
There are many worlds, but they share the same sky. One sky, one destiny.